Um, whenever I am in doubt, I just look at it with my eyes. And, and that should give me the right amount of information that I need to, to be able to judge something. Because seeing through the eyes means you also see, you see it through your emotions. And in the end, um, lighting is so connected through the emotions um, that you cannot disconnect one to the other, which a lot of engineers are doing, and which we try as designers to bring it actually back in there. It's every lighting designer's task to, to bring emotion into his lighting design. Emotion is so much imprinted in everything that we do, it's not something that I just see as something separate. We only see reflected light, and so when a person uh, comes into a room, sees a space or on a place, uh, we try and help them to see that and experience that a little bit better. The light art installations, where we are actually an artist, no longer a designer, the difference is in the fact that we are uh, no longer working for somebody else asking us to do something, it comes from our own inspiration. So it's our own expressive means that we're using to convey something. So, first of all, I would say that uh, this work is uh, not really my work, it's, it's my passion. I rolled into it when I was on a quite a young age, and uh, it's something that I've really grown to love uh, as it is, and you really have to respect it as it is. It's not something that you can mold or uh, do something else with. It's, uh, it's my passion, that's what I can say. I think our style is uh, uh, to be human, is to try to be in innovative, is to, uh, we like to experiment with uh, new things and having art installations entertainment is, is a place where we can easily do experiments that afterwards we use into architectural. On the other hand, art architectural things gives us um, some, you know, foundations that we afterwards we use actually in those other things. Uh, I think you evoke uh, through a concept, through a narrative, or, uh, or through an, an imaginary image, uh, the atmosphere or the emotion that you want to perceive. Um, that is the, the methodology. I hate products. It's uh, the moment I need to put products into my uh, designs, it's where I kill the dream and let me explain that. As long as the image lives in my head, what I want to conceive and it's there, it's a livable, breathable, organic thing that I can shape, mold and do anything that I want. The moment I have to make it into a technical reality, that's where the dream is, you know, frozen, put into a glass cage and then it becomes just this thing that you have to then get to.